Tantsuaki <laughs> And so then the fifth line in this prophecy, uh, again from before, reads that his benefit, his uh, service to others, his altruistic benefit is like the peak of the king of all mountains. And so what this means is uh, showing that um, not just Ken uh, Jin and intention being always to bring vast benefit to others, but the basic model of the entire universe, the entire institution, um, and all who study is to dedicate one's life and one's studies for the benefit of others uh, of all different levels of like superior and middling and lesser students, disciples, followers, whatever category they fit into for all beings without exception to um, dedicate one's studies and knowledge to benefiting them. And so that's why his kind of enactment of the altruistic activity to benefit others is compared to like the supreme peak of the mountains. And so this uh, also is not only the model or the goal of this one founder, but all of the students for each and every one who participates in the studies at this institution, it is uh, instilled in them the importance of the motivation and the intention behind the studies to be a very magnanimous one, not one that is limited for one's own sort of self-accomplishments, such as, for example, oh, if I get this kind of study, I'll be able to support myself and make a good living and make a lot of money and all of this, but something much broader, something that is for the benefit of others, all beings, whatever category they fall into, whether supreme or middling or lesser, and just to uh, dedicate one's life and one's studies. That, that, in other words, the goal behind all of these studies should be motivated by altruistic motivation. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Then you can't go to the moon, and you can't go to the moon. 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 Jordan, <laughs> Uh, and so uh, whether the students are monastics or renunciates uh, or whether they are lay people, all of us try to hold to this altruistic dedication to service to others, benefit to others. And so, uh, and also to the preservation of a precious tradition, a precious uh, uh, a legacy and tradition of uh, truth and uh, spiritual significance, and to uh, preserving that and spreading that in the world. Uh, but that's like our principal kind of motivation. And so, Kenshin Jimei Puso Rinpoche, when he was in Bodhgaya, he uttered a spontaneous, uh, like, 
almost like a prayer or a statement in verse in poetry. And it translates as, um, may the stainless uh, teachings of truth uh, always spread and flourish for a long time. And may all beings, without any segregation or without any bias, may they all live in the glory of well-being, benefit, and happiness. And at all times, this is the only prayer I have in my heart. And so what this is saying is that his uh, entire like, state of mind was just completely dedicated to preserving a precious tradition, a tradition of teachings, and sacred wisdom, and also to bringing benefit to others without any segregation or bias, without discrimination to all sentient beings, to bring benefit, to bring happiness. And this was a tradition that he set forth, and that's kind of the model of the entire institution and also in throughout the world to bring benefit and to spread the kind of the teachings of altruism. And so actually um, he was saying like, at all times, this is my only thought. This is the only thing I am concerned about is benefiting others. Not like us ordinary people who we have so many different thoughts and intentions, but usually they're just based on selfish benefit and self-centered goals. But he wasn't like this. He was completely focused on well-being of others and establishing benefit. And we, uh, who are his, consider ourselves his disciples and his, his followers, of course, it's difficult to truly uh, accomplish a state of mind such as his. But we at least try. We try to emulate that model. And we always try that no matter how much we are studying, yes, learning and studying is important, but we try that our motivation behind the studies and the learning is always coming back to that it is of benefit to others and that we can bring benefit to others. <laughs>